Uh, this question is a matched payers um, question, continuing on from uh, in that section of questions. So we have some people that are weighing themselves before and after some particular diet after two months, and we're going to try to determine whether people actually lose weight on this program. All right, so the first thing we need to do is put in our data in. So we click stat, and then we start entering our numbers. So we'll put the before in list one and after in list two, and I'll pause and come back and enter the data. All right, so now I've entered my data. So remember, when we do a match pairs question, we have to go over to list three, and we move over, and then we hit the up arrow to go up one, and then we say we're going to take list one minus list two. And we press enter, and it calculates those values for us. All right, so now, since this is matched pairs, remember matched pairs, if it's a test, hypothesis test, we do t-test. If it's an interval, we do T interval. So we're going to go down to the option for T interval. So remember, match pairs is always T test or T interval, depending on whether it's a hypothesis test or, an, or a confidence interval. So we have our data, uh, and our data is in list three. Remember, we always have to change this to the third list. And we leave frequency at one. Confidence level for this question is uh, 99. And so we calculate, and we get negative 0.6 to 20.4. So it looks like D... Um, is the right answer based on that. So that matches our answer.